Hey everybody and welcome back to the next episode of City Skylines. I'm Edition Dutch and welcome back here in Dutch City as we take a look at our Metro Plaza station from the content creator pack train stations which we installed in our city in the last episode and as you can see a massive amount of people are using our new Metro Plaza station our new hub in the city and today we will continue with the other new content creator pack bridges and piers and we're gonna take a look how we can use that dlc in our city to get more detailing and better looking paywalls and bridges but i can't Keep my eye on this, it's looking beautiful, especially in the dark. All the people are walking here, it's well used, spent money and time building this new plaza station. So, I will sit you at night and we're gonna focus ourselves on the grey walls. So. Let's get the normal daylight here and see if we can get one here. Yep, we can. Gonna take a look at the grey walls first, all the piers and bridges. We go to the landscaping and disasters because I have the extra DLCs. And here we are with the bridges and piers from the content creator pack. And as you can see, there are a lot of new quays with Russian pads involved. And these are basically the simple one. Let's upgrade a few. This one is the simple seawall. It's got a seawall type quay with pedestrian pad. And we got the fenceless gonna put it next to it see the difference lovely brick wall pedestrian pad on top and the one with fence and the fenceless yeah kind of like this one just as a basic one if you want to park behind or something you can easily connect your walking pads to the way walls to get some extra dimension into your park and there are of course a lot more so let's have a look got a split level got a tiered seawall with walking pads on top and below so let's continue but as you can see you need a raised land for this one so we can take a look at this path here raise the land and pause the game for a second because i have a huge amount of residential so i build it we'll be there in a minute so this is the height too high all right <laughs> so that's too much <laughs> right so you got the two level and you got a one level we do a bit anarchy no we can't oh just a single one Which one is this? Yes, this one is only a walking pad on top. And to reach it, there is a gray wall with the stairs on both sides. And this is only a, a walking pad on top and a decorative stairs. You don't see a lot of difference, to be honest. Let's see if we put this one next to it. What is the difference? Mm, I think only for the game that this one has the walking pad enabled below and this one hasn't. I think that's the only one. And then we got a wider way wall. I think if you gotta mix this one. It's not the best looking. She got both 
with walking path and without walking path below so it would be better if there was also a wider one with the stairs i believe so you match that one up together and that's the wider one we got and of course without the walking path below and what do we got more we got the simple city quay uh, fenceless now let's go back here this side and let's upgrade some parts here with fence and without a fence a little bit more detailed than the first one more roughly in the bricks and this is a bit more detailed i think i like this one more to use here in the city and of course with a fence and without but it is looking so much better than the standard wall without even a plastic pad on top so i really really prefer to use this one as much as i can i think and as last we have the same with the wider just like the other one and also one with the dustian pad below i see the difference and uh, one without and then we come to the two that i like a lot we got a wider one with some kind of stairs you see this one more in holland bigger cities the same with this one with some smaller stairs it's really nice that the lightning pole is extending precisely at the same spot as the stairs <laughs> i would say we move it once but to the left or the right <laughs> but that's just minor detailing so that is it for the quay walls and of course there are some more with the bridges and the piers got this one a european pedestrian bridge and the american pedestrian bridge so let's build one in between here and building the other one next to it oh it's getting in trouble with the play walls we use anarchy so the first one is the america or the european nope i'm sorry mm. oh the american is the first one here smaller one yeah pretty simple one because i think if we take a look at the normal walking path it's not yeah, of course, there is some difference. The pillars they are different. It is more detailed if you love it. I prefer the European one. I think twice as wide as the American one. And the lovely stone pillars. Kind of a bow bridge. Those two are also included in the pack and yeah i love i love even though it's wider i think i love the european style over the american style and then as last in the parks and plaza you get also the content creator packs you get the rhine pier and the san san pier Pick one up. Yeah, I'm not sure what to think about that one. Maybe it's looking better if you use it with a quay wall. Yeah, the water's high enough. <laughs> you can 
use it for a boat or something. And we got the other, oh, this one, the Rhine Pier. Simple decorative, decorative pier with small entertainment radius based on ones located on the Rhine River. All right, entertainment level 75. I think the same for this one, yes. So you can detail gray walls even more. So that's it with the bridges and piers content creator pack. Let's remove this one. So let's see how we're gonna use it in our city. Because I noticed if we are gonna use the new ones here. Our park is freely accessible from all the directions. Or I don't have to, if I don't connect the walking paths together, then it's not a problem, I think. No, if I don't connect them, I think it will be fine. So let's see which one we're going to use. We got a small one here, small river. And I don't want the bigger one. But I think I'm going to go for the simple city quay. Hmm. Parisian style. Got the fence. So let's upgrade this one here. I do want the bigger one at the front. I think I'm going to do the same one here. And then connect it up with another type. Go on a bridge. It's perfect. And I do want to connect this one. Yep, I do want to connect this one. Put the key off. And that's connected. Perfect. The same on this one. And let's do the same here. Now people can walk along the river here. And they can't reach the park no that is beautiful we don't lose any money with our fence back if we can come on anarchy is on it's still refusing i'll fix that later and I think I want a bigger one here from the front. So let's take a look. Which one we're going to use it for. I don't want the double level. Do we have this one? Or do we want this one with our, our windmills? Hmm. I'll take for this one. It's only too bad there is not a nice connection. Connect two different types together. But maybe in the future someone will build it. Hopefully. Up until... No, not until there. Mm, let's take the big one with fence. Yeah. And we're gonna end up with that gray wall. And continue with the walking path. We're gonna and why not? 
Uh, of course, we have the the gravel pad. I was looking for the name. Got that one here around our windmills. So let's continue with those. Connect that one up with the lovely new gray wall with the walking path so people can walk around there and this one can be concrete that's not a problem And for this one, let's think. Mm, yeah, I think for this part, we will continue with this one. And yeah, completely all the way because we were building our zoo. All the way up into the river. So let's just continue. I'll finish the back. And think the same for this side. This one is still pretty low. Getting up in this area. So now we can use the two level maybe. Let's fix the sun. So we can have a better view. Uh, better. How is this one looking? With the stairs and... I think this looks beautiful. Which uh, between the normal one and the one with the stairs. And here we can use normal one with fence. I think it's looking beautiful here. I think if you make a walking path from the street here, make it anyway. Now people can walk here. Till, yeah, till here, why not? See a skyscraper, you can walk. Yours here you can walk easily have a nice walk next to the river and yeah i think i like this i think i like this a lot of course there's some more detailing we need to do i think i'll spend one episode it's got some more subscribers since my last video so thank you for that I really appreciate it, all the likes, all the views. I really appreciate it. And if you have more feedback for me, just let me know in the comments. I'll try to respond on every comment that is being given on my videos. If you like it or not, just let me know. And together we can make this into a better city, hopefully. So the last thing I'm going to do here is upgrading this existed river bridge from our park into the European bridge. And because we don't have any ferries around here. So the thing that is better looking together with the nice walls in the back. I really love it. So what are we going to do with this one? I think we'll leave this one with... As long as it's not too high. Then I got to fix it. Off camera. It's already occupied. Yeah, that's fine. High too high. Yeah. I thought so. I'm going to fix that. Off camera. But for now, I think we got some lovely changes with this new DLC. 
with the wider gray walls here around our windmills i think it's a summer night people can walk here sit here relax here together love it and then our new european style bridge together with lovely gray walls behind here with the stairs walking paths two levels so yeah i'm really pleased about it i think i'm gonna use it a lot especially of course gray walls around the city and it gives an upgrade to your detailing and visual style in the city so thanks for watching again Hopefully you liked this episode as much as the rest. And if you don't subscribe yet, hit the button. I will be pleased with the news with every new subscriber I got. And leave a like behind if you like the video. So thanks for watching and see you next time. Bye bye.